ISI 2010, question number 9A. U is what we have here. From the stone geary or uh, utility function, we know that we'll get an X1, which is S1 plus M minus P1 S1 minus P2 S2 by P1 into alpha by alpha plus beta. So that into half. Okay. So the entire expenditure on X1, P1 X1 will be equal to P1 S1 plus M minus P1 S1 minus P2 S2 by 2 P1. Sorry, by 2. So this gives us M by 2 plus P1 S1 by 2 minus P2 S2 by 2. Can I write it? So the budget share which is P1 X1 by M will be equal to half plus P1 S1 minus P2 S2 by 2M. Can I write it? Right? Now, this is say the budget share, say P1. P1 is equal to some constant plus P1 multiplied by some scalar K minus P2 multiplied by some scalar L. Can I write it in this way? Where K is S1 by 2M, L is S2 by 2M. Clear? So can the budget share be expressed as a linear combination of P1 and P2? Yes. Answer yes. For the budget share. Okay. What about the demand function? This is the demand function. Okay. The demand function is basically S1 plus M by 2 P1 minus S1 by 2 minus P2 by 2 P1 into S2. Can I write it in this way? Is this linear in terms of the prices? I have a P1 here in the denominator. I have a P1 here in the denominator. Is this linear in the prices? No. Can this be expressed as like this? P1 into K minus P2 into some L. No, I have a P2 by P1 expression here and I have a 1 by P1 expression here. That is obviously not linear in prices. So the demand function is not linear in prices, but the budget share is linear in prices. So the demand function is not linear in prices. The answer is no for the uh, demand function and yes for the budget share. Okay.